All right, everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Now, in today's video, we're finally doing some more mods to the JCW. Now, the last mods that we did was de-chroming around the back, de-chroming the back end, and it looks insane. And today, we are moving around the side of the car because we're going to be de-chroming the fuel cap, the door handles, and the belt line right around the whole car. So this video is possible today because the guys over at Kill or Chrome actually sent me out the fuel cap and the door handles. So go check them out. All their links will be down in the description. They sent them out today and they should look insane when we install them. And uh, the Kill or Chrome, they do everything basically to a mini. Whatever you want to do to a mini, they can probably provide you with it. So go check them out. They're in the link in the description. And a guy called Joel, he actually said he bought some tape for his mini and he couldn't be bothered to do it. He said he would take them too long. So hopefully it doesn't take us too long in this video, but yeah, he sent us up the tape the, that goes around here um, to decro on that. So I'll also leave his Instagram down in the description as well. So go check him out. And um, yeah, without further ado, let's get this boot open. Here are the mods and let's start installing them. Okay, so we have the door handles here that we're gonna be putting on, the fuel cap in here and the tape right here. Now this will take the longest, so we're gonna do that last. We're gonna do these first, the door handles and the fuel cap. So um, actually, we're gonna start off with the fuel cap. Okay, so the fuel cap is here and this is the new black one. Now, there are two types of caps that you can get. You can either get one that replaces this, where you take this off, um, or you get what well, this one, which you just stick over the top, which is much easier to put on. But this isn't actually hard to do. What you do, you open it up like this. To do this, all you got to do is get a tiny little flathead screwdriver. There's a little pin, and you just want to get your screwdriver behind it, pull it out, twist the cap uh, on the outside, and then it comes off really easy. Um, I actually just did it to make sure. Um, but this one is easy. This is just tape that sticks over the top. Now, I've already given the whole car a clean, so this is already clean. Okay, so all the tape is off, and this should be very easy. You just line up with this and stick it on. How hard can it be? All right, there's the original fuel cap. Get this one. Line it up like that. And on it goes. That is on very sturdy. Let's give it a close. Oh yeah, that is. That actually fits in. That actually fills the hole a bit more. So it looks bigger and more chunky. I actually like that it going over the top. That looks decent. Take a look. Oh, just de I love de-chroming. It's so satisfying. Look at that. Now it's all blacked out. That looks so much better than the chrome. Because that's a big bit of chrome as well, that. So getting that gone is so nice. But yeah, really, really pleased with that. I literally took two seconds to put on. Um, and it makes a massive difference. And I'll put all Kill All Chrome's links down below, like I say. And uh, you'll be able to find all these mods that we uh, are doing today on their website. Okay, so now we're around by the door handle. And uh, as you can see, we have the black door handle, which is going on. Now, the same again. This one is just going to be sticking over the top. Now, we're going to take this 3M tape off again. And it literally just goes over the top like that. And that is how it will look. But obviously, that is not on properly just yet. So let's get this tape off and then let's put it on. The longest bit about actually doing these mods is taking the tape bit off. All right, there we go. So, like I say, this is the right-hand side door, and literally, it doesn't have the key slot, but let's be honest, when has anyone ever used this? If your battery dies, then that should peak, to be honest. Um, but like I say, it's only a stick on one, so if you really had to, you could yank it off. But here we go. Easy, look at that. Again, another, another mod that just looks insane. Take a look at this. That goes on very well and there's no chrome, there's no chrome showing at all around it. As you can see, it literally fits on there like a glove. You wouldn't even know. I am very, very pleased with that. So just do the other side. But this is basically what it looks like. Look at this, blacked out. Completely blacked out, so it literally fits so well around there. Blacked out fuel cap, easy done. Blacked out door handles, bang. And what we have done, we, the other video, we blacked out the mini badge, blacked out the John Cooper works, and these surrounds are actually from Kill or Chrome as well. Um, these were easy to do. All these mods have been so easy to do so far, and it is transforming the car slowly but surely, and um, eventually the front is the next thing to do. The next modding video will probably be the front. 
dechroming all of this, but we haven't got them yet. Okay, so with the tape, this tape is perfectly sized, so it ma so it literally goes exactly over this chrome. Now, we're gonna start on this little panel here, so we just get an idea of how this is gonna work, how long this will take, and hopefully it doesn't take too long, and hopefully it's not too difficult to line up and everything. So, you get your tape and you just line up how much you're gonna need. All right, so I've cut off a little bit of tape, and then, this now is gonna be going on here. Now this is gonna, oh, this is gonna be difficult. I already know. I already know. We're gonna try this out. And if this if this takes too long and it's too fiddly, then I might have just to buy a whole replacement, like a whole belt line, which is what the guy did who sent me out. This is what Joel did who sent me out. He's actually bought the whole new belt line kit because he said this was too fiddly. So let's try it out on this little bit and then we'll see how it goes. All right, I'm having a look at it. Take a close up of this. Okay, so I've given it a go, uh, really briefly, really, and there's a tiny bit of chrome at the top of there still showing, and quite a lot underneath. So I, I don't think this is gonna work, personally. It would be too fiddly, take too long, and yeah, that's just gonna, that is too fiddly, and I don't think it would actually look that great after, so. I'm gonna actually just take it off and probably have to end up buying the whole replacement for that because that is gonna be way too fiddly. And personally, I don't have the patience to do that, I'll be honest, that is so long. Okay, so I've given it a couple more attempts at that tape and it just isn't working properly. It's not going on, it's, it's so, so fiddly and it's just, I don't think the results are gonna be that great at the end of it, so it's just not worth. I reckon that'll take hours doing that. It wasn't perfect and that was annoying. Um, you could see chrome like either side of it, so. I didn't want that really on my car, I thought it would look a bit tacky, so I didn't put that on. Um, so we've still got the chrome around the whole car, which is kind of annoying. So I was looking forward to putting that on, I thought that would have been alright. I wouldn't have minded spending a bit of time on it if it would have gone on a bit easier and I wouldn't have had to spend... So, uh, it, just, it would have been so annoying, uh, I can't be bothered to do it. Um, just for it to look a bit rubbish at the end. So uh, yeah, we're going to not do that, but the two very successful stuff from Kettle Chrome have gone on and they look insane. I can't be more happy with them. That is unreal. They wouldn't even know they're on there, honestly. Bang. Just a door handle at the end of the day and they look so good. Same with the fuel cap. Wouldn't even know. Look, look how good that fitment is. That's insane. That's perfect. So yeah, super, super happy. Another set of chrome has been deleted now um, and yeah I think next time we'll be moving around the front we'll be doing a lot around the front we'll be doing the badge that badge dechroming this this will take a while I think just set the whole front bumper off so that'll be difficult and these which should be very easy as you lift the bonnet up and replace them so that will be another transformation of uh, as I walk through a tree but um yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed this little video uh, today de dechroming this beautiful car um, and yeah, from this angle now, with that more blacked out look, looks insane. I'm so, so pleased. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you have, leave a like and subscribe down below. And we're going to be doing so much more to this in the uh, upcoming future. And once again, a big shout out to Kill All Chrome for sending out their mods. They look insane and I'm so pleased with them. Uh, like I say, all their links will be down in the description. And thank you, Joel, for sending out that um bit of tape unfortunately didn't work annoyingly but um yeah also his instagram will be down below he's got a really nice jcw as well so um yeah thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next one